Well, Mauna, um, like you said, um, where the mining activity is um, currently going on is just some few meters to the main road. And uh, for the residents, they say no one can convince them that uh, any auto local authority is not aware of the, the, the distraction. Now, when we inquired, initially we were told that the miners brought letter to the um, um, EPA, Environmental Protection Agency, that um, they have been given a contract to do dredging because we have the main or river passing through where they are currently operating. Yet you go there and you see um, not less than 10 excavators and also chamfer machine uh, meant for washing, and that is the activity they are doing. So currently EPA, EPA is not aware of any mining activity there. Minerals Commission too says they are not aware of any mining activity going on there, meaning whatever is going on there is termed as illegal. And the residents are not happy because we have um, churches and houses very close to where the activity is going on. And they do not understand why um, authorities will not come in and stop it because apart from the destruction of water bodies, their livelihood and lives are also at risk there. So some of the residents, especially a pastor that I engaged, said that um, they want to see urgent action being taken there, else they will be left with no option than to take the law into their own hands and find a way of um, eliminating or moving out all these miners from that place. Um, let's listen to what he has been telling me. And <laughs> Any man penny a kufado. Any vice president, Omo Mano may is idea with you. And yes, I give it Papa Conomono or many new. And so, Ibrahim, based on what he says, it's no surprise really. I mean, I've been to Kumasi in the last few weeks and you see it very openly. Is it the case that authorities say they are not aware? What have they been telling you? Well, so we, we have been trying to speak to the uh, municipal chief executive who is the head of um, security in this area. Um, since morning, uh, he told us that uh, we should give him some time. Uh, in fact, he says he has some explanation to whatever is going on there. So we are waiting for that explanation. So it, it means that uh, he cannot tell us he's unaware of whatever is going on there. But at least for the EPA and the Minerals Commission, in the uh, municipality to tell us that um, they are unaware of whatever is going on with regards to issuing of licenses or whatsoever it means whatever activity going on there is illegal and the residents are saying that um, it started way back but now it has gotten very close to the roadside that is um, of more concern to them because they don't know what will happen to the road maybe the impact of that illegal activity to the main Accra Kumasi road. I mean, and and we see, we Rungu, see that some of the... The main Accra Kumasi road. Uh, and I'm saying that we see that some of uh, the, the mining has gotten close to, to the main road with uh, very big holes or gullies uh, near the road as well. I mean, for motorists, I'm sure they will also have some concern in relation to that as well. Well, exactly, Mauna. Um, motorists have a lot of concern because, like in the shot that you said, um, there is this huge hole that has even eaten portion of the uh, main road. Um, that was not as a result of the illegal mining activity, mm. but this is something that um, they have been calling authorities to address, yet they are not seeing anything positive being done there. So they were even hoping that if we even allow these miners to go, go ahead with the activities, then first of all, we have to fix that portion of the road, else um, it's just a disaster in waiting. 
we may have to wait until something unfortunate happens before um, the authorities will come to their aid. But in fact, the mining activity, like I also said, is also contributing to um, that um, caving in because it has gotten very close to where, the, where that patch has caved in. And gradually, if we don't take care, it is likely to have effect on the main um, Kumasi Accra Road.